Shaw with what you can expect as you head off the door. I mean, you really have to stay on it these days across South Florida because you wait a day, things will change. Yesterday we had dense fog. This morning we're cooler than we were over the last 24 hours, down anywhere from a degree to five degrees thanks to that cold front. Now the cooler air is still filtering in, so it's going to be throughout today where we'll really feel this. It's not terrible out there right now, but we're only going to make it up into the upper 60s for a high. So we're close to that range even right now. Low 60s on the Treasure Coast from Sebastian to Vero Beach. We've got 59 in Fort Bassinger, 60 in Okeechobee, as cool as we find. Mid 60s in Martin County, 68 in West Palm, and still pressing 70 from Del Rey to Boca. So, you know, we're thinking cooler than average. Well, not to start, but to end, because we're only going to be here confined to the upper 60s to 70 at best. We'll call it an impact situation for the first half of today. It's just a big change from yesterday. Variably cloudy skies, but dry. So that's a big change as well. And I don't know about you, Yasmin, but I'm glad it's dry.